Hello everybody, Burnt Out Guy here, and welcome back to the crust. Alright, so last episode we uh, were doing the mining outside here with the, the mobile mining rig. <laughs> Trying to find the words there, it's pretty early in the morning. Um, and then we got uh, vehicles going back and forth, delivering stuff. And those vehicles are bringing that to here. I did encounter a bug. For some reason that uh, after a while they just weren't dropping this off here um the only way to get past that is i had to destroy this and restart it again and then they were they were doing their thing right um i added more batteries so i added the large batteries and another row of uh, medium ones so then that way we have uh or small batteries i guess and then that we have more power uh we're able to fill up the bar so uh, that's pretty good we don't have to add uh, any like, larger solar panels Mm, I don't know if I added any more solar panels. I don't think I did. It's possible. It's possible I added like four rows. Oh yeah, I did. Yeah, I did add four rows. Cause uh, these. Anyways, um, it's possible. Anyways, I don't remember. <laughs> Lots have happened. A lot of time has gone by. All right, so now we go down below where I've changed a little bit of stuff here. So first things first is I got the smart bricks. Uh, I changed that around a little bit. Added two of them and put two containers. Changed out the small um, containers here for the larger ones. Did the same thing down here, opening that up because it didn't like being straight up against the wall. Um, we backed up on a lot of stuff down here, which is good. So a lot of time has passed. Over here, I hooked up the iron. There was uh, like 17,000 units or something like that. We're doing pretty good on chewing that one away. We chewed the aluminum away. Um, that one's completely gone. I put a ice one here to slowly work on the ice one. And I've been making fuel with it in the meantime. And then we'll look, see, we got like 2000 fuel. So we'll be able to sell some of that and make some good cash. Or you can see we already got some pretty good cash up here. And then the last thing I worked on, which took the longest is I wanted to separate the rooms and mainly because like uh, the CPU power thing was getting like a little out of control. So now you can see that like, we're up to a thousand CPU. So now we can have like uh, all kinds of uh, more automation happening. Uh, this is where they're going to sleep. This is going to be the recreational room. This is going to be somewhat of an automation room. Um, probably mainly just for... Uh, the carbon fibers for now and then if i need to build any other rooms i'll build other rooms because this is all going to be temporary eventually all that's going to disappear this is temporary um i got another ice node over here which i noticed this one has two hundred and forty six thousand units in there that's awesome so i'm going to bring that down and i'm probably going to start like an ice line with it and then we'll generate our own fuel and, and send it up here. Um, and then after that, we continue with the rest of the, the automation is the plan. But for today, I think we're going to start actually using all of this. This is why I prepared all this for. So if we go back up here to the map, um, there are a few things that we never did, right? So there was this, this, and then... Uh, I think Atlantis is where you're going to go and rescue the people afterwards. So, we are going to send all this stuff to Charlie. Um, I do have quite a bit of these, so which is good. I'm hoping that I have enough of them to complete the mission um, and send them everything that they need. So, yeah, we'll, uh, we'll see how that goes. So, first we're going to send the expedition here. And then we're going to choose this one here do i i'm gonna take that one here actually i'm gonna go fill and back and then we're gonna send him perfect all right so he's gonna change gears he's gonna go back to the surface and he's gonna come up here and get loaded Urgent contract. Uh, no, because I don't need it right now. Um, what else? I think that's about it for now. So we'll wait till that happens. The outside here where I've been mining, I've been doing a pretty good job. Uh, let's see if I can click off of that and onto this. All right. 
So I've been pretty much all clearing out uh, the titanium that's been around here, which is pretty good, burning it down almost to the, the regolith. Um, and then I'll just move to different areas afterwards and, and keep mining like that. Uh, eventually we might have to make more of these and send them to different types of minerals and have maybe like one truck or two trucks coming back and forth because if you take a look at this, this can hold quite a bit of regolith and it can hold a lot of it, from what i can tell it doesn't seem to have like a, a an end like there's no buffer end like there's no max i don't know i'm just guessing um because i am up to seventy three thousand units in there right now so that's pretty intense um this one here has twenty thousand in it and then when we go downstairs i can't get the belts any faster right now i'm at the max that i have uh, researched so like these are just these ones are full now that took a while I could upgrade these ones here too and get more materials out but as you can see i'm not really oh that's actually full now wow that's awesome all right so that's good uh i should be backing up on a few things here that's good actually i'm kind of full that's happy that that's full these are all full too oh is that why it's pretty much all full because uh oh it should be still making plates Oh, I guess all the plates that I'm making. Why is that going? Do, do, do. Where are me plates here? These ones right here. And those. Oh, this. Uh... Oh, okay, so you can only put 1,024 into there. Interesting. Oh, that's good. I'm really happy that some of that's starting to back up. Because then we can do more stuff with it. Good, 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 good. I'm happy about that. All right, so. Let's uh, get on with it up here. How's this thing doing? Okay, so you're on your way to go to Charla. You're on your way back, and you're my standby, so that way when I need to send materials, we'll be good. Not enough water to operate the module. Really? What, this thing? So do I need, like, a, a upgrade of that? Like 60 water. I don't know, man. Unless it was talking maybe about one of these things I got going on down here. Interesting. I hear a lot of things like crashing and dying out here. I don't know. <laughs> seems seems like it. Storage is full. That's crazy. So all this is going to be all full. I'm happy with that, though. Other things will get made. All right, so we're almost to Charlie. Should be anyways. Getting there. And we'll continue on with what's happening. I think it might be also uh, this cargo terminal is a thing too as well. I'm not 100% sure which one is the one that activates the, uh, the whole thing. No clue. But we're about to find out. We're about to find out. This might be just like, you know, something. Just like a backstory thing. Who knows? Or it might be this one that we need to do. We'll find out very soon. Very, very soon. As you can see, this guy's going to come drop off another 4,000 regolith. And if I had both of them going, like, it would drops it off a lot. And then we got some more rare earths coming down. Boom. I love that. It's so awesome. These belts are so retardedly fast. All right, so we get science from that. All right. That's interesting. That's interesting. Okay, so this is the, uh, this one is the one that we have to go and investigate. All right, let's just send an expedition. Send the scout. <clears throat> and then backup vault. Really? The structure is a spare parts storage facility. Do I have to... Is this a pickup? I'll pick up resources from over there, hopefully. Hopefully it's not something that... Uh... Oh yeah, it is too. That's great. That's beautiful. So I get some free materials. Love it. Oh yeah, look, there's a plus next to it. So it's not I don't have to bring materials there. What's happening down here? I heard a boop. 
No offense. How's that research coming along? Speaking of research, I did a lot of bloody research. Um, we're all the way down here. So we got programmable splitters, modules. Um, did some upgrades for here. All kinds of upgrades. Uh, over here, I'm working on down here. So we got robust welding. That's good for our our um our buildings they break down a little less often with the drilling speed going on another drilling speed we got efficiency for that uh, did the helium three and and the uh, the harvester so we can do an ice harvester on the surface which is pretty cool and then social i did a bunch of stuff here in the social too so that way we get uh more more cool stuff so we got to do something about this. It must be uh, we're not creating enough water. Um, speaking of which, did I not? Yeah, see, I think it's... Doo -doo -doo. I'll take this one off and I'll put that one on. The ice melter upgrade. So that way we're, we're melting more ice. I think that would be good. Let's uh, prioritize that one. There we go. <clears throat> there so that should help uh up here we got you making your way your other power it's fine you're getting there slow but surely slow but surely uh it's okay it gives us bides us time to uh do some research i'm really happy that these are all backing up that's pretty crazy these are the frames so once we start back in here in the frames, all frames will go into the box, which is pretty cool. So a hundred of those and those, I'm not even making them yet. Soon, soon. Uh, that will be the production that we're going to come down here with, but I want to try to get rid of this first. Especially the ice. The ice would be good. To, it's a lot of units left, though. I don't know if I'm going to be able to get rid of it all in time, but I'll try to get rid of it as much as I can. And then maybe we might do some... Uh, some selling for that as well. Like 800 and something. I don't have that one hooked up to the, the rest of the slag, so I've been having them empty that crap manually, which is fine. Um, I don't even know what my guys have been doing lately. What have you been doing? Oh, yeah, I sent you guys mining, right? That's true. That's true. So I have them mining this out, and then I'm going to do the strip mining thing going back and forth. And mining all that out. I forgot I had them mining. That's very, very true. Wanted to see what was uh, going on on the other side over there. So, all right. So he is on its way now that he's powered up. That one's bringing back resources. That's pretty awesome. Uh, what are you? Okay, so you're bringing stuff there. No, no. I want you to uh, unload here. I don't want you to put that in there because then it's just going to fill it all up full of junk. Perfect. And then you can uh, leave the base. Did it drop that stuff off? There it is right there. There we go. So at least we got a little bit of extra materials from that. That was nice. That was very, very nice. Um, so we're backing up on slag pretty bad here. That's pretty harsh. I wonder if it's because we're almost full on there. Probably. <clears throat> no, no, not really getting enough of this in really anymore. But then again, that's just going to back up eventually because I'm not selling any. And then I'll all go towards there. But then I should start selling bricks, right? That would probably be a good thing. What do we got for bricks? We got a thousand bricks there. And that's actually pretty good. I don't want to sell those, though. Uh, a hundred of each science. But I don't really want to sell those. Do, do, do. Use this one. 5,000 bricks. 30 days. Am I making enough bricks? I doubt I'm making enough bricks to fill that. 700. 
trying to figure the ones that I can do on. Uh, I've done a pretty good job with them. See, I wouldn't mind doing that one. That one wouldn't be too, too bad. I can make room for some, some, some steel as well. Alright, so we'll put you on the largest cargo ship. And we'll just do 9,000 at a time. Roughly. So you can do that. here wish there was just like a button you can just hit like max and then I would be done all right that we can change for the first one and out that's gonna keep that a little bit so I will do this there we go now everybody should haul There we go. Objective Perfect. achieved. Yay. Director, we have received a transmission from the station and have responded with the coordinates of the Atlantis complex as directed by Crust. We can... What? Incoming call from Crust. Transferring to you. Director, you are holding Hope 2's navigational materials, which give us the correct course to the point of impact. Save the coordinates and destroy the flight recorder. The contents of the flight recorder are the property of Crust. It is in your best interest to comply with the instruction without further questions. I'm counting on your discretion. The contract requires us to comply and destroy the onboard recorder, which could reveal the reasons behind the crash of Hope 2. It seems that Crust cares more about preserving its secrets than human lives. The question remains, what could be so valuable that they would delay evacuating the crew from the damaged station and risk their lives? We could eliminate the data and forget about it, or examine the black box data before destroying it. But in so doing, we risk falling out of favor with Crust. What do you say, Director? All right. <clears throat> so since we already let the Hope Station crash, right? Um, and we're not really in their favor to begin with. We're just going to... The data from the Hope 2 flight recorder turned out to be incomplete. It's as if someone deliberately deleted everything related to the meteorite, leaving only the coordinates of the impact with the lunar surface. However, even the fragmentary information was enough to reinforce Professor Wilfrey's doubts about the official cause of the disaster. More and more signs indicate that the meteorite never existed. Questions continue to arise, and the answers are on the far side of the moon. Hope 2 deleted the most interesting things, as if they knew the information had to be destroyed. I can't blame them. No one should be trusting Crust. But now, I'm even more eager to get to the bottom of it and find out the real reasons for their caution. Director, there are coordinates for research storage among the data. I suggest we take a look at this place to see if we can find it. All right, so, 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 that's kind of interesting, actually, right? Um, so here, Atlantis, it's a private lab, a research depot, so we can just send a transport. You're pretty idle, so we'll send you down, fill all, and return to base. Um... There's no expedition there yet, huh? So that's probably... All right, well, we'll wait to do that. We'll see, we'll see what happens next. Send materials to IFE. Really? What materials do I have to send? This one? Could be. But it also needs the engineers. I think it's the only one that's left on the map. Oh, that's the ice one I never did. But mind you, I could probably do it. Now that I'm storing ice. But uh, we'll just go like that. We'll bring you down here for now. Just because I'm not 100% sure. And then we do have one rover left that's kind of sitting around doing nothing. So we don't have to wait for... Anything like that. 
Hmm. I was really sure that um, how that triggered uh, more stuff, but I'm I'm pretty sure though. We'll, we'll just be patient. We'll we'll let our rover get over there. But everything seems to be doing pretty good down here. Not enough water. Yeah, eventually I'll finish that. Uh, we got 25 days left on that, so that's not too bad. And then I should be able to upgrade it. And we'll stop hearing that, which will be good. All right. Ugh, I'm gonna be stuck at that for a while, I think. All right, so that contract should be just over done. How much more care do we gotta give to them? Oh, so they're sending it all the way over here on this one. Interesting. Very interesting. So they should all be coming out to do this, hopefully. Looks like it. That's good. That's good. All right. So let's go here. You're on your way back with those materials. Interesting. You. I don't want dropping the materials there. All right. I'm going to cancel your task. I'm just going to get you to drop them right here. And then we'll send you back outside. Beautiful. Leave my base, sir. So. Really? Complete the green power contract. Send materials to our... Oh, is that this one? Do, do, do. Maybe. Maybe it is. <clears throat> Maybe it is. We'll find out. So, we need the larger one. And you'll be next. Who knows? Contract seventeen days. We should almost be done sending the last. Or we did and no. Director, we have detected an object approaching the surface of the moon. It must be Ah There we go. So now hope is actually crashing. Awesome. <laughs> so this is like one alternative to it, I believe. I, I believe you actually can save the station. But, uh, yeah. Reminds me of the movie Mars. Or the Martian. Low oxygen. And you're nowhere near anything. You are screwed. How do you survive? Yeah, doesn't look promising, right? Director, we received a message from the Atlantis complex area. We transmitted its coordinates to the Hope 2 station, so perhaps the crew managed to evacuate successfully. All right. So, if we go in here... Manager tried to outsmart Crust, and now the information he wanted to protect is his team's only chance for survival. It's hard to think about it, but we have to take advantage of the opportunity. The data could be useful. Alright, rescue the station. Set an expedition. We need to take one of these trucks. We need to send them this stuff. Director, we're closely monitoring the situation with Hope 2, and are aware of the offer you received. You already know that Crust made a deal with the station's commander, and the crew is not prepared to fulfill the terms. They leave us no choice. Director, you're not seriously concerned. Okay, so what he wants to do is, like, shut the power off on them and kill them, I think. And that's just not going to happen, because we're going to save them and they're going to come live with us. So, 
I should be able to get a uh, a guy over there in time. Uh, let's go back to the surface here. Oh yeah, unpause. <laughs> that would help, wouldn't it? All right, so you guys, hopefully, are gonna bring fifty to that first, because uh, that's a lower priority. This was the higher priority. So hopefully they do that. So he's going to go here. Come on, everybody. Don't disappoint me. It's only 50 of them. Do, do, do. So if I make that like a low... Okay, so you're just done with that. Come out. Just 50. Okay, so you did get them. Good stuff. Alright. We'll put that back on to normal priority. Yes, yes. We're getting there. We're getting there. I'll be making more water soon. Alright, so that's good. He's on his way. That should complete that contract. Yay. Contract complete. Get a bunch of science. Now she's going to give us a new contract. Holy boys, we aren't even making them yet. Nor them. So that's uh, that's going to wait a little while. And then... You. This should be the last load for you. Which is good. And then... We'll come out here. They're going to need more after this. So this is just like the first trip of, of things that you got to send. That's why I'm glad I got this other rover over here. Because it's going to send another one right afterwards, right? And then I don't have to send him home. To pick it up and then waste time going back. I can just kind of like... I'm prepared. I'm prepared. Kind of. <laughs> uh, just know how the rest of this is going to all play out. Alright, so you're pretty much well done mining there. I guess I could send you here and dispatch you there to mine. Because that's just kind of like light green now, right? So you're almost there. That's good stuff. Beautiful. Uh, let's see what happens. And? Now send a cargo truck with drones to fix the facility. Remember, our friend's time is limited. We're going to send this truck here. Expedition. Yeah, get that in my way. Fill and send. Alright, so you should go back there. This one here... I should be able to just send back to base. Move to there in case something else happens. That's good. That drone can stay there. First power unit, you don't want to touch it. Because I don't care about doing that to them. I'm not cruel. I'm a nice person. Alright. What do you want? No. And that water thing's starting to get on my nerves. <laughs> 94%. We're almost done. Alright. Uh, you're not on your way yet. Uh, okay, now you are. That's good. That's good. So it says 20 days. They want us to do that in 20 days. I have no idea. I don't want to do that. Um, and then that's rescuing them. So that's bringing them the stuff so that they can survive. Which is good. Ah, yes, 98%. There we go. That's that's good. That's good. Very happy. Very happy. We're almost done with the research. 100%. Awesome. Let's research go down complete. here. And then upgrade you. There. So now you should be able to produce more water. Hopefully. And then I shouldn't have to hear that ice melter thing crap no more. All right, what do we got down here? That's the, oh, okay. So that one's almost done. Uh, where are you? That's you. Okay, so you're just green all the way, huh? Uh, computer desk. Uh, I think I'm gonna go for ice extraction. I really don't. Yeah, that wouldn't be a bad thing. But what is it for the the regular thing? The ice extractor. Probably, eh? That wouldn't be bad, because then I might be able to get that uh, thing emptied faster. 
Awesome. So... Do I need to make another one of these? Like, move these out of the way and put two of them here? I'm, I'm, it's looking like that. Uh, truly saved us. Thank you for not leaving us stranded. Regarding the data, I promise you find a back copy of the black box on the central data server. Before you ask, I guess it is still on the station, which is likely collided to the moon by now. The server is well shielded from outside elements. It'll remain intact even if everything else is irreparably destroyed. Wow. Uh, you need an encryption key to access the server, and I'll send it along with the coordinates to the resource storage right after this message. All right. The official version of Crust is just a cover-up for something bigger. I can't wait to look at this data. Director, we're very glad that you managed to maintain the functionality of the complex and save valuable scientific staff from the station. Oh, well, sure. <laughs> the Hope 2 crew has been through a lot, and they need time to recover. Remember that we can't rely on their conclusions right now. We will conduct our own investigation into the provided data. Continue to act according to plan. Yeah, acting according to plan. Alright, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to move this thing. Uh, the electrolyzer. Do, do, do. That would probably be here. Where do we move this? Out of the way somewhere. Um, let's just put it down here. I think it would be a good place for it. And then you I say water tank. But see there's like water here. Why is it telling me that there's like no water? Like I don't get that. Maximum capacity, maximum output, charge rate two. But then it seems full, right? Interesting. Uh, alright, so, let's get rid of you. And we'll, uh, anything that's happening on the surface of the moon right now? Okay, so no, that guy's just coming back with the rovers. I don't see any new question marks. Or exclamation marks. No question marks. Yeah, I don't see anything yet. Maybe when that rover gets home? Maybe. What's that rover carrying? Just rovers. Interesting. So, that's good. Let's make that a priority, please. And then, let's copy that. Good, I can put them side by side though. That's Research nice. complete. Uh, do, 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 right here. Over there. There we go. That should be good. Research complete. I want to go here. I want to grab that next. Urgent. It's Earth. I got a bunch of signs for it. Let's do it. Let's do it. That gives me 7,000. Oh, nice. All right. I should start putting it on the other landing pad, though, because that one's pretty far. What is this? Okay, so now they shouldn't complain about water anymore. I got like two water makers in here now. That's good. There. That that's gonna stop annoying me. <laughs> Alright, another urgent contract. Uh no. I'll only do one urgent contract at a time then. Um so they want me to complete that. So I still didn't get people yet. I'm really kind of thinking I was gonna get people there. That's kind of disappointing. <laughs> But, uh, yeah, anyways, uh, what else is there to do? There's no other storyline crap to do. Um, I guess in the meantime, I did see that ice one back here. 
Maybe I can go send this guy with some ice. Since you're not really doing much. And then... I'll take a little bit of time because you got to come back home. Or, no. Where am I storing ice here? Maybe I got to go here. I can let them take from there. Contract complete. Beautiful. Okay, so they should fill you up with ice. Research hopefully. complete. Oh, I that. Give me the research. Uh, what else here? I'm trying to concentrate on stuff in here, like kind of in a way. I haven't really done anything much with fuel and making, but then again, fuel factory upgrades. I haven't used any of those yet. Engineering. Let's go with the underground ones, and then we'll try to... Um, that one wouldn't be bad either, right? Eh? And try to get the faster belts. Maybe we can start moving more regular faster would be great. That'd be a good thing. So I'm just waiting on more or less uh, them supposed to give me a mission, but uh, I don't see anything. They were supposed to be, that's just a private lab. I don't know what I'm missing here. Yeah, everything else is just contracts. I don't have people to send you. I have the materials. I just don't have the people, right? Um. Yeah, and I don't see anything else. This is crazy. Wow. I'm flabbergasted. And I got lots of science happening here, too, which is really nice. But uh, what are we supposed to be doing here? I, I could be, like, you know, setting up factories and stuff. But, oh, can I? Um, I still can't delete this freaking thing. Why? <laughs> Uh, I really wish I would have known that at the beginning of the game. That you... Only, uh... You can't do anything about that. There. Expedition Center. You can only have the one. Man, that really sucks. Because that really screws me up for what I wanted to do and bring up all my resources up here. That means I have to find a different place to kind of, like, bring them up. That means these might have to change places eventually, maybe. That would really suck. Cause say like I did all my elevators over here. Well, what if I just brought all these ones up, right? And then I could put my elevators here. I wonder where there would be on the map. Probably somewhere over here, maybe. Then maybe it wouldn't be so bad. I'd have to check that out. Because you'd have to start them from upstairs, right? Like these stupid elevator things. So if, um, go for an example. Uh, are they under conveyor belts? No, they're not. What are they under? Logistics? Yes. So... Oh, okay, look down here. You can see. Oh, I never noticed that before. That was so well thought of. Okay, so if I wanted them there, I'd have to move my power. <laughs> my power stuff. Hmm. See, that's almost more doable. Than. Because, like, say I just, like, went duck, 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 duck. All the way to here. That could probably work. You see, like, these ones are all right in the front. But even then, that could almost work. Like, yeah, I think it'd almost be better off moving all the chests over. And then I could almost do that there. And then I just have to move this and replan out this somewhere else. Like, down here. I could probably put all that down here. And then since I have that uh, technology now where I get back everything that I had 100%, I could just sit there and rebuild it and destroy it and get back all the materials from it, right? And then I could only use just the big ones and use the big solar panels. 
and all these materials I would just get back. That's a pretty good idea. I might do that uh, in between the next episode and prepare for... Because what I would like to do is try to automate this thing here and then have our materials going into there. And no matter what we're producing down here, we could just automatically send them up here and, and complete contracts, which would be like the the best thing to do and then not have to use the rovers to deliver your stuff. And I could use the rovers just for like mainly mining and doing little things downstairs and helping out. I think that would be the good thing. So I'll let that keep playing for now. Um, but that's a really good idea. I think that's what I'll do. I'll be like an in-between episode thing where I'll move the power infrastructure down here. Since they're not letting me move this damn thing, which I find really stupid. I don't understand why, but um, I guess that's bad planning on my part. But I didn't know you could move it. So uh, other than that, man, I think we we did okay. Um, I'm really disappointed that like we're not advancing in the story at all for some reason. I don't understand why. Um, which is kind of weird, but let's go down here and send them there. It's the only place I can send them. It's the lab where I can buy research. But I don't understand why I didn't get another mission prompt, unless that I have to finish this one first, which would be kind of stupid, right? Hide quests. That's my only quest. Like, this is dumb. You think I would have got, like, the rest of the information that I was supposed to get? Sniffle. Well, I don't know what to say. I really don't. I I, I really thought I would have got people. I would have rescued them or something. They would have come to stay with poor little me. But that doesn't <laughs> seem to be the case. <laughs> oh, oh, no. So, um... That, that was really a kind of an uneventful episode so far, isn't it? Um, wow. Wow. All right, so we're going to try to complete this contract and um, see what happens, really. Um, it just needs 15 and 50 of those. Do, do, do. I have 14 and 9. So I said 50 and 15, so 6 and 35. So, do, do, do. If I go uh, 35 of these, and then 6 of these, it's not that bad in price wise. Uh, I just want to go downstairs for a second because these use those and I want to make sure that that is off. Perfect. All right. That's good. So let's go back upstairs. Let's throw that here. Then I don't have all the carbon fiber yet. I can send them that. Missing here. Oh, that one up here. See, I gotta remember to change that. Where is that? Here. Send resources. Landing site. Landing platform. Because the other one's just too far. Alright. I seriously have one person doing that? No, no, no. no. Stop that. That cannot happen. We need more people out there. And they're all busy doing stuff here. They should be getting this. There we go. I might have to buy a little bit of carbon fiber. I think I'll do that. Even though I'm making it, I'll just buy it. I'll buy like... Uh, 35. There. I should make the plan over here. Or whatever. There you go. That should tell 
I'll complete that contract anyways. Oh, yeah, okay, that was enough. So I'm missing just one of those? What? Did they use that one of those ones for something else? I wouldn't be surprised. I would not bloody be surprised. Uh, here, let's just buy like, I don't know, 15 more. My god. These guys. I hope they're not putting all the... Okay, so that contract is complete. There you go. Let's see if the rest of the storyline continues. I'm hoping. Objective achieved. Thank you. Perfect. I'm hoping something else is going to happen now. Like, that's... Because there's, like, nothing going on. <laughs> <laughs> Did I just hit like you know a wall in the story or something like you know? I don't know what's going on. There's no other, nothing else to check out, man. That's just the private lab that I keep going back for for science. Like this is crazy. I don't get it. I don't get it at all. Well, I'm lost for words, man. I'm absolutely lost for words. I'm just going to call this one, Did I Break the Game? <laughs> because there's nothing there's nothing happening anymore. I just got contracts. Uh, I can do it. You know, just because you look like Elon Musk, I'll, I'll do it. I'll help you, Mr. Elon. I will help you. Research complete. Uh, transport... You're pretty close. And then fill all and send. All right, so I guess I'm I'm at a loss for words, man. Uh, I really, really am at a loss for words. I don't know if I broke the game or or what the heck is going on, but I'll let time go by for a little bit and I'll see if something transpires. If not, well, then I I, I really don't know what to say. But um, I hope you enjoyed the video, everybody. Peace, take care, and uh, hopefully we'll see you again on the crust. <laughs>